Hey everybody, my name is Adam, and today I have... Sweet, so I, we're going to be playing Infinity. I brought my Yu Ching, you brought... Uh, Pano. Sweet, Pano, and we're going to be playing, uh, what's the mission? It's called Highly Classified. Alright, let's see how it works. Let's see the table and the forces and all that good stuff. Alright, it's going to be a little bit loud tonight as we're here at Gaming Night at the Sword and Board, so bear with the noise. Um, but here is my 300 points of Yu Ching. I have a Su Jian, um, a Hussein Lieutenant over here. I got uh, a Tiger Soldier, a Gui Lang Skirmisher, a Ninja. Um, these are both hacker. well all three of these are hackers. Um, we have four Zan Shi, um, three forward observers and just one regular one. Uh, I got a Rui Shi um, to hopefully shoot through the smoke of his visor um, that, uh, that these four uh, Shaolin monks will be thrown down. And so they're all in a combat group and then everybody else is in a combat group together. So let's see how this list does. It's been a while since I played Infinity, um, so we'll be, uh, we'll be making some mistakes, but have fun with it. Um, to get, send me some tips and tricks or maybe some list tweaks to, to optimize this a little bit better. Um, and yeah, I look forward to seeing your guys' comments in the description below. So let's go ahead and look at Leo's for us. Leo's 300 points of was it Pano? Yeah, it's Neo Terra specifically. Great, let's see what we got. Okay, uh, that's my HVT over there. I've got a link team of four Fusiliers. There's a hacker. Uh, that guy is going to be a guy with a combi rifle. That's going to be a Ford Observer, and that's going to be a paramedic. Uh, that's my engineer. Uh, that's a Squalo with a heavy grenade launcher and the little crab bot that comes out of him. Uh, this is a uh, Clipper drone bot uh, with a smart missile launcher. That's a Pathfinder drone bot. Uh, this is a Forward Observer Auxilia with his Oxbot. That is a Locust Hacker. Uh, and then that's all one combat group. This is another combat group. And I've got a uh, CSU with a breaker rifle. And I've got an EBO mule bot. And then a regular Minesweeper mule bot. And uh, this doctor here is proxying as a uh, tech bee. So not a doctor, that's a tech bee. So we're playing highly classified tonight. That's the, uh, the mission of the night at gaming night tonight. Again, which is causing all the noise. So bear with us. We're just here to have some fun. But we figured you guys might want to see the game too. So. Um, we have four objectives that uh, anybody can get, and then we each have one classified objective that nobody knows what that is. Um, so here we go, we got data scan, uh, retro engineering, test run, and espionage. So you can go through your deck and check that out. And obviously, anybody can trade in their, uh, their classified one for secure HVT, so we put that in there too. All right, let's take out the board. Here's our four x four table set up for our game today. We have a combination of some starter sets that terrain from Ice Storm and Red Veil, vale, um, as well as some MDF terrain from Sistema Gaming. So let's let's just zoom in and show you just a bunch of crates around. Some cool cool gaming mat from GameMat.eu, really industrial. There it is. So that's our table for today. Now let's uh, let's do some pregame stuff and set up and deployment and all that. All right. So first turn deployment, right? Yep. So I succeed. I fail. Uh, what do I want to do? I'll try to go first. Okay. So that means I choose deployment. That's right. And I probably want you to deploy first, right? Yep. So I can see you. Go for it. What side? Oh. I choose the side as well. <laughs> let's take. Let's take this side. Got it. So you guys are deployment. We're all set up, ready to go. So uh, Shaolin monk. We got the, the Sujian, another Shaolin monk. Um, Shaolin monk, a prone Zanshi on the roof. We got a Sen warrior with HMG. Uh, a Zanshi, we have a Shaolin Monk, my Ruishi, um, and then two Zanshi on the roof, both prone, trying to hide. Uh, my HVT is right here, and as well I have two camo markers, one here and one here. So, Leo, why don't you tell us what you got? First, your HVT is hiding over here. My HVT is hiding way back there. So they're pretty close together. Should be fun. 
Um, I've got my Minesweeper mule bot. That's my tech bee. I've got an engineer hiding back here on this building. There's my Squalo. Way underneath here, I've got my Auxilia with this robot. Link team's over here. Uh, the hacker, combi guy, and the paramedic up here. And then that's the forward observer. Uh, I've got my uh, clipper bot over there. I've got my pathfinder bot over there. I've got my EVO minesweep, uh, my EVO wheel bot over there. And I've got my uh, uh, CSU over here. And I deployed my locust over there. Sweet. So that's the table, that's the deployment. We are all set up. Leo has the first turn. Let's see what he does. So, yeah, of course. So you want the little group limit? Right. Yeah, so I'm gonna use I'm gonna start off with a command um, a command token and strip him of some orders in his uh, in his little group. And uh, so alright, let's see what he does first. First order from the little combat group, which is pretty much the only one I can really use. I'm gonna use this to have this thing set up kaleidoscope, which is a special program that it gets. Uh, any of my hackers that act, uh, it's basically it gives them like mimetism. It means that anyone in a face-to-face roll against my hackers have a minus three against me. Sweet. So, order on the uh, locust. He's gonna move for his first order to here. He's gonna try to stay out of sight of that camo marker, but I think I can do it. Yeah, you're good. And the second move is gonna be to go to here. Line of sights are base? When you're prone? Can I maybe shoot you? Yeah, you should be able to see him. All right, I'm gonna shoot you with this edgy over here. Okay, cool. I did not see that one. Uh, combi rifle? Yes, so you're plus three range, but you're minus six for my ODD. So uh -oh. minus three. Here we go. Miss. Oh no, you hit. I hit, miss two. Uh-oh. Watch me feel my armor roll, because this is what I do. <laughs> yep. <laughs> He's unconscious right off the bat. Okay. <laughs> I did not see that one coming. Sorry. <laughs> This guy. Okay. Now that she surprised me, it's revenge time. So he's gonna just go idle, stay put. Okay. She can see him. Yep. So she will. Uh, hmm. I guess just try and shoot you back. Okay. I'm gonna shoot you with shock ammo. Uh, shock ammo. So if you hit me, I'm dead, right? Yep. It's a multi HMG. So I get four shots. Let's check the range. Yep. Oh, oh we're just out of 32. So I think you're at a minus six. Okay. Minus the cover. So I gotta get a two. I should check for combi rifle though. Yeah. And you need? Um, I'm minus six, so I need nine. Because I have ballistic skill 15. That's it. One, two, three. Oh, dirty. So it's power 15 and anything plus the uh, cover. And anything you fail, you're dead automatically. And. So that's still a 14, so that's not good enough. Nope. So I take two, and she'll be dead. She'll be dead. Yep. I spent an order on this link team. I'm going to make this paramedic the link leader. She's going to move in. So we're checking to see if everyone's in range first. First thing you do, everyone is. Then we move her four. She's going to go straight ahead. Um, he's going to stay put. This guy's going to stay prone and just move two inches forward. She is no longer prone, she's just running up. And this guy will move a bit further forward as well. I'm trying to stay out of sight of that guy. Yeah, this is what he's worried about over here. And then another order, the second half of the order, I'm going to move to here. Hacker will move another two. <laughs> And I checked to see that everyone's still in range, and they are. And that's the end of that order. And I'll spend another one on them. I'll spend another one on her. She's going to remain a link. They're just going to pop into the door so she can see this guy on the ground here. Try and bring him back to life. And try to shoot him with her little paramedic pistol. All right. Uh, this guy's going to move another two inches. Nah, he's, he's happy where he is. He's in cover. Cool. Uh, I think he'll still be in range too. He's going to stay where he is. Yeah. And I got to measure range for med kit, which is plus three out to 
eight, and that's just out. So it's just straight ballistic skill for her. All right, let's see what we can do. And the ODD is not working. At least I don't think it is. Unless it's out of zero ballistic skill, so ballistic skill of 12 to get this guy with her medikit. All right. Oh, and she misses. Activate again. She's going to do pretty much the same thing. Uh, okay. Yeah, just stay here. Let's roll it up. This time she got it, so now I've got to pass a physical test on my Locust. His physique is 12, minus 3 for a medikit. Okay. So he's got to get a 9 or under, and then he gets back up, otherwise he's dead. Alright. 6, it. he's fine, so he's no longer unconscious. He is prone right now. I don't think anyone can see him. No, it should be good. I'll spend an order on him. Okay. I'm gonna move him. Yeah, he can just get up. I'm gonna move him forward into the corner here. And second skill, he's gonna attempt to hack your HVT. Okay. So I'm gonna go for this one. All right. HVT espionage. So uh, I need to hack get the HVT whip minus three. That's right. All right. My whip is 13 minus 3. I need to get a 10 or under. I fail. That's a 19. Do it again. Try it again. All right, try it again. 10. I fail again. Oh, you have. You can't. Oh, no, 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 I got it right. I have 13. I forgot. Yep. So I got a 10. Yep. I got it exactly. Sweet. So I have succeeded in this thing. Does this have to be a separate thing? I'm going to spend an order on this guy to move him to the other side of this building. Moving four. And then another few to peek out the corner there, where I don't think anything can see him. Sure. And then that group to move this guy out. He's going to move six. Actually, I'm just going to move him six across so he still gets some cover if something comes at him. Uh, no, I'm going to move him forward. I want to try to get him in better range. So now we're are we shooting? Now you can see him. Yeah. So I'll shoot you. All right, I'm gonna try to shoot you as well. Okay. I got you within 32 now, so that's my good range. Okay. You're only a minus three. All right. I am a plus three minus three because you're in cover. So straight ballistic skill for me. And I'm gonna use shock ammo again. And I'm just minus three overall. Yeah. So on an eight. Great. Here we go. You got a one. a 1, I got a 12, 5, and 11, so you can hit three times. So oh, brutal. Alright, here they come. Three. Oh, pass. That one definitely one. will fail, he's dead instantly. Oh yeah, shock ammo. Yep. There he goes. A token and another order, um, uh, and I'm gonna put... I'm breaking this link team, and I'm putting a whole bunch of people on suppressive fire. So I'll put her, him, the Squallow and this guy all on suppressive fire. Uh, Sounds good. Yeah. Is it? Are the only 13 physical? Yeah. Oh, okay. Here we go. Shaolin Monk, the first. He is going to move. So he'll move to uh, there. Are we good? Yeah, no one sees him. All right. So no arrows there. So now he's going to try and drop a smoke um, right there ish. Make sure it's gotta be able to see the point. Oh, okay, yeah. Don't cheat, Adam. <laughs> Put it. Oops. So right there. So it's touching both boxes here. All right. Let's do that. All right. So I need to get a 16. There it is, that's a one. Yeah. yeah, that's a one. So that's the smoke. And that's his. Shaolin Mung right here. He's gonna use his impetuous order. So Yeah. Right. So let's do that. As fast as possible towards the closest model who's over here. Um, so there he goes. Arrows. I don't see from over there. I don't see from over here. I don't see from over here. Oh, she can give up her suppressive to shoot at you. Uh, those guys are pretty effective. I'm gonna do it, so she'll give up her suppressive and take one shot at you. Okay, so I'm gonna uh, dodge and smoke. And I'm gonna put it 
right there ish. So yeah, let's put it right. Does that block me from you? Yep. Right there? Yep. Okay, great. So, <laughs> center is right there ish. Okay. So you hit me on nines. Nines? Okay. You can do a 16. Let's so. I got a three. I got a five. You beat me. <laughs> so smoke this down. Smoke's down. So I've uh, done some thinking. It might be harder for the Rushi to take down the big daddy, but uh, so the Hassan warrior is going to try and do it. So here's an order uh, to move. Just see out this box here. So I can see the head of the dude over there. Where is he? Is it not, can you see nothing else? I can see with her as well. Oh, yeah. She can't do anything unless you shoot at her. Yeah, but the smoke's all here, right? Yep. Yeah. So. You have to shoot at her for her to do anything. Right. Okay. So yeah, just the big, the, just the big guy. Okay. Well, I mean, yeah. We'll see what I, we'll see what I do. I can't I guess. do anything, so I declare nothing until you declare. Until I declare. Okay. So let's just put uh, all four shots into Big Daddy here. Okay. Big Daddy's gonna shoot you back with an explosive shot from his multi HMG. How the heck does he do that? It's a multi HMG, so it's got a different ammo. But how can he see me? But as soon as you declare a shot against him, he can shoot back at you just at a minus six. Anybody can do that? Oh, okay. You're just like, you see the trace around through the smoke and you just shoot back. Yep. All right, well, let's do it. So I'm ignoring your cover because the range and cover cancel each other out, so I'm just a straight minus six. Sure. And you're probably plus three. Yeah. Yeah, looks good. So I need, he's at... I need nines on one dice. And I'm 14 plus three is 17. All right, let's see what we get. Uh, so with a 16, I got a crit then on a nine. Oh. I do not. So you hit me how many times? Uh, one, two, three times. Okay. So, yeah. All right, damage 15. Yeah, damage 15. What do we say? Sevens I need to get? Seven. Yeah. Sevens to equal it, or do you have to beat it? I have to beat it. Okay. I have to so beat I it all three it. times. All right. I'm gonna. I can choose to fail my courage roll and get into cover. Okay. That's what I'm gonna do. All right. So he's over there now. Yep. Let's uh, <laughs> let's put another order on him and. Uh, I guess I don't move. Yeah. So Are your straight ballistic skill against me? If I go at him again. Yeah, yeah. So I'm cover now. Which is still fine. Um, but I think I'm going to switch it up right now and just try and kill somebody. So I'm actually going to shoot at her. Okay, sounds good. She is going to be minus six cover range at least. So that's like minus 12. So I'm just going to dodge. Okay. <laughs> so I'm still on 17s. Yep. She dodges on a 10. I got a 19, so you hit me, looks like three times. Three times. She's in cover. Uh, her armor's one, plus three, four, I need 12. No, she's dead. So I'm gonna reveal my my ninja right here um, as this, this camo marker, and I'm going to be doing surprise shot hacking uh, this, this what's it called, Locust? Locust, yeah. Okay, and I'm using, what is it, the murder program? Red Rum, Red it's called. So I'm going to break my suppressifier to defend yeah. myself. Yeah. I'm going to hack you back, yeah. Oblivion, which if it succeeds will isolate you. All right, so I'm at minus three because of Kaleidoscope. That's right, and, you're, and I'm at minus six because of your surprise shot and because of Red Rum. Okay, so I'm, at, I'm doing tens. And I'm doing, uh, well, right. I fail. Yeah, and I got two hits. It was you a, got two it was hits. A four and a six. Okay, so I need to make four rolls against my BTS. Ooh. And it's damage sixteen. Fail, fail, fail. He's dead. All right. No bringing him back this time. Cool. I've done a little bit out of order, but I'm gonna spend a command token to re-roll that hacking roll. It was a four and a was it a six or an eight that you had? I had a four and a six. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna to try to re-roll it. I got a twenty before. This time I got a nineteen. So I still fail. I'm dead. All right. There goes the locust. Right, this Guilang dude is going to reveal um, so that I can hack the HVT over here. So we will give him an order to do that, uh, and it's just a. Will, willpower minus three? Yep. Okay. So let's see if I get it. You got it. You should do it. And so we'll take a point there. Let's say I'll be uh, I'll be these smoke tokens because I have lots of smoke. Uh, monk is
is going to uh, just move up to the edge of this wall. Uh, just right here. This irregular order, and he's going to try and drop a smoke. Right here. Let's see if I get it. 16. Yep. Do. And so he's done. And so what'll happen next is I'll give an order to the Sujian, who will, in his kitty form, run six plus two for his first short skill. Any arrows? Nope. Pretty sure I blocked it here. Yep. Cool. And then second short skill, he'll go. I think it's two, yeah, two. So I'll go to the other two. And then we will give. Hmm, let me think for a second. Sujin, an order before he moves. He's going to switch forms to combat form. Then we'll go up. Four to there. Yeah, I definitely can see him. Definitely can see. Yep. Not with anything else. All right. Well, then we will sh we will shoot the the B, the tech B. Yep. Okie dokie. Uh, well, the tech B is going to shoot you back with her uh, her flash pulse. <laughs> Try and blind me. Yep. Okay. So in combat form, I'm BS 14 with a Spitfire. Spitfire is. Plus three. Plus three at 24. Great. So I'm at plus three. Easily within 24. Yeah, yeah definitely. I'm within 24 as well. I'm plus three. Great. Flash pulse, minus three. So you're we're both straight ballistic skills. Straight BS? I'm, I'm, with, I'm willpower. But okay, great. Five, three. So I hit with three. <laughs> got to beat a nine, which I can do. I don't. I don't even hit. So I got hit three times. Three times. Two, two of them. She's dead. Doing pretty good. I think I will give him one more, and I'm going to sneak up the wall enough with my first move to just see that that one robot, which will be right there is good enough. Just shoot with the Spitfire again. I can't do anything. I can dodge. Okay. I'll do. Let's, uh, let's roll it up. Let's see. Minus three, to seven. No, I got a three. I canceled that one out. Yeah. <laughs> so then you just take two more, two. right? Two. Yeah. The so bot has armor two behind the cover, plus, so it's so five. Plus five. I need tens. I feel both. He's uh, double unconscious. Still on the board, but double unconscious. Okay. And do you have stuff that can repair him? Yes. All right. Well, we gotta take care of him then. So one more order. Make him dead. And just keep shooting him. You sure you want to do that? I don't know. He's worth like eight points and doesn't shoot anything. Oh, Gets yeah? rid of mines. That's all he does. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. We'll, we'll do something else. Challenge Monk spending his irregular order to go four and then. Another four. Same thing over here. Spending this irregular order to go four. Nothing can see me. If you get out, I can. Oh uh, no, not yet. Okay, so then I will go four to same action. Four to four to there. You're safe when they can see you. Safe? Yep. Woo! Safe, alright. Shallon Monk will also spend his regular order to go four. Yeah, I can't see. We're good? Yep. Alright, and then we'll go four again. There. Okay, taking an order. First one is six. Uh, I think I might need to do two orders to get there. I think you might, yeah. Yeah, okay. So, first order is just a move. Um, yeah. So we'll just do the move to there. Yep. Okay. And then the second order. Here we go. So, can these move out and back as well? Which? The robots? They, yeah, anybody yeah, can just move out and back and shoot. You can shoot at any point in time in your movie. Yep. Yeah, crazy. Well, let's do it. Or actually... Wiggle out and back again? Yeah, wiggle out and back. 
wiggle out and back. Okay. And at that point in time, I will shoot the guy. You go press order left. Up. It's right. one order left. Yeah. All right. I'm going to. Who are you shooting him? Oh, to him, right? The little, the little guy. Yeah. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna dodge because I can't hit you anyways if I don't. Okay. So uh, let's do it. Okay. So straight BS would be 12 for me. I got one crit. You and crit. That's it. I got a crit. I don't. Alright. I pass the dodge, but I don't crit. So you got me once, and I'm unconscious. Okay. Shorter will make up for, uh, for <laughs> being out in the wide open once the smoke's gone, and we'll just take that last order and hide back there. Um, right, right where the two were before. So, I think that's my turn. Let's see what Leo does in turn two. Two. Okay, so what I've done for the first little bit is I've taken these two guys, the EVO and the, and the CS you that are in the little combat group and I'm spending with two command tokens to move their orders into the main combat group so now I have nine orders instead of seven beautiful so I'm gonna start spending orders on this thing to go around the flank here so I was gonna move six to here no arrows and then four I'll spend another one I think we decide all the way up it's cool, right? spend another six get to here and then four up to there Yep. Uh, spend an order on this guy. He's gonna peek around the corner to see that ninja. Yeah. And he is going to uh, attempt to forward observer. I think forward observer. He's uh, possibly doing something sneaky, something that I don't know about. Maybe one of his highly classified uh, objectives, who knows? Okay, uh, let's do it. Uh, so, uh, are you doing anything to react? Um, is there anything I can do to prevent it? <laughs> I don't know. Can you shoot or so dodge? I definitely can't shoot you. So just dodge that. You can dodge. Okay, then, you can dodge. Yeah. Do you have a half decent physique? Uh, I don't know. I mean, you would assume so as a ninja, but she's only 12. Uh, I got her in the open too, because she would have to be touching this thing yeah. and be obscure. Oh yeah, she's, she's wide not. open. She's wide open. Yeah. So I am at under 24, which means a plus three for me. Uh oh. Or is it plus zero? No, it's plus zero. So plus zero minus six for the TO camera. Okay. On two dice. All right, let's do this thing. So I need sixes, and you need whatever your physical is. It is 12. I get it two. Okay, and I need sixes. I got nothing. Nope. So that failed. All right. You gonna try it again, or you gonna do something? another order on it. It's gonna be a full order. Full order. Yeah. I'm going to do something that anything that has the forward observer skill can do. I mean, anything that has the sensor skill can do, which this thing does. It's one of those toolkit robots. It means I make a ballistic skill shot against you. Okay. Taking all modifiers into account, I only take a minus three. Total. Total. Cool. Regardless of how much the modifiers are. Yeah, have. you just use That's your little robot eyes and just shoot me. <laughs> Zero in on it. Great. Gun you down. I'm excited. So you're going to try to dodge against that, and I'm going to shoot you three times. Yeah, here it comes. Yeah. You're a six. So you succeed, and I'm ballistic skill 11, minus three. I need eight. Eight. There's two. Four and three, but you beat me with the six, so oh, you dodge. Right. You can move if you want. Oh, yeah. And I dodged on the first one, too, didn't I? Yes, you did. Good. So, okay, so I do need to start moving places. So here, I'll take my my first one to, to there, and then the second one that just happened will just go around this corner right here. Second? Still not quite in cover, so... Ah, well, bummer. I think I'm gonna... Yeah, that's as far as I could go. Okay. I think I'm gonna try to shoot you with that one more time. One more time? The best. Okay. One more order. Uh, so here we go. I'm on a 12 again? Yep. I got an 11. Uh, I got a credit. I don't. Okay. So I fail. And she'll go. I got it. Uh, last two. Brings her right around the guy. And there she is. Swallow? He's going to. 
do what's called a uh, speculative fire. He's shooting indirect with his heavy grenade launcher and dropping the grenade right there behind these two guys. Uh oh. He can target any point on the ground. It's a minus six. Yep. Straight to do it. That's his it. ballistic skill's 50, so he hits on a nine or under and gets both of those. What guys. can I do? Can I dodge? You can these? declare a dodge to this at a minus three. Okay, sweet. So I will. So I have to hit first. Okay. On a nine, I crit. Oh! <laughs> So unless you crit dodge to cancel that out, okay. then, guys. <laughs> Let's try. Yeah. The ninja, no, and the uh, the monk, no. No. So they're both unconscious. Uh oh. That sucks. Okay, that helped turn things around. <laughs> that did. That was awesome. Boom. <laughs> <coughs> not worth going after. Eh, it might be worth going after. That. They don't get armor or nothing. No, not with the crit. Oh right, crit. Yes, crit. yes, crit. <laughs> crit. Oh, crits are so good. Crits are not good. Anything next to him? No. That's not a bad one. But because I can get rid of the Zanshi. But I might it might be better off going after the camo too, because then you can't do anything with a specialist. That's not a specialist. Is that a specialist? Uh, I have forward observer, forward observer. Where's the other? There's three forward observers. Uh, you've killed the other two. I'm gonna spin up. Okay, I'm ready? Yeah, I've been recording. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. I'm gonna spin another order on him, and I'm gonna basically drop it right back here. Got it. And bomb him. Uh -oh. well. So, same deal. Okay. I got a 12, I miss. Okay, I, and I dodge. Cool. So I can move, right? Yep. Let's do that. Um, sure, we'll take it right to there. Being the that guy, he's gonna bomb him again. One of the good things about this maneuver is it, is it ignores their camo and everything. Yeah. It's as so long good. as I land the shot, they can then attempt to dodge, and that's it. Bring it. All right, on a nine, and I fail again. All right, and I'm dodging. Yeah, I do. Um, if I go out, then you can see me. Could you shoot me for that? No, 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 not right now. And that's your last order? Yep, it's my last order. Ah. Well. Do I need the movement? I might. Okay, then I'll take it. I'll take the dodge up to there. This maneuver here was useless, but it set me up well for the next turn. Actually, no. We, that's stupid. You just stay there, buddy. We'll dodge. We'll dodge back the other way. Correct that mistake. I should have done that the first time. Here you go. Okay, so what's going to happen first is this impetuous order is going to happen. Yep. I'm going to move one and three. Let me know if you can see me. He's going to see if he can try and see me over there. So to there, that's probably the point where you can see me if you can. And I can't see you, I don't think. No. Then I'll take my other three to there. How are we doing? Check the back guys. Yep. Put it right at the corner of the building. Yeah, the back guy can see you here. Okay. Okay. So I finish. Do I finish my move? Oh, and this guy can see you back here. This is the Oh yeah. Okay, well that's happening. Uh, he'll shoot you, he'll flash pulse you. Okay. So he's gonna finish his movement all the way to there. And he will dodge smoke and put it right there. So plus three for him, yeah. minus three for this guy. So we okay. need nines. Let's see what we got. We need a nine with the shot to kill you and a, and a, and a, a 16, with, no, a 15 with the other one. Okay, I need a 16. I fail my smoke. So I, got a, I need a 15 to flash pulse you. I fail that. Uh -oh. And then I need a, a what did I say, minus three. I need a nine with the uh, shot. I got a six, so I hit you with the combi. Okay. Um, gotta do some armor. What's the yep. damage on this again? Thirteen. Thirteen. Let's see what I get? Six. So he'll go on. He'll go on couches. Blah. All right, and the smoke is not there. They don't have dog in, do they? Yeah. This Shaolin monk. He will do his impetuous order. This is a four. Yeah, yeah, no, that, that thing is blocking. Building blocking. Okay, so he's to there. The building's blocking. You're saying? So we'll drop the smoke right there. Cool. This is my second. Uh, no, he fails it. No. This guy. Uh, and then the last 
fast, impetuous. Let's see here. So I have to go. We decided that guy was the closest. So straight towards him does put me right there. Okay. Uh, I think I can see him. Okay. <laughs> Good. Uh, these other guys probably can though. Oh shoot, yeah, he was right by this mark. Straight four inches back. So he was right here. Actually, you're nicely blocked over there. Yeah. Uh, but this guy can see you. Over there? Yeah. Great. So, uh, he's gonna smoke bomb. Uh, a flash pulsey. Right there. So plus three for me. Plus three for me. I finally passed it with an 11. I got a six. You beat me. Okay. Smoke lands. All right, beauties. That's all the impetuous orders. That wave is fine. All right, here it is. This is the maneuver that's gonna happen. We're gonna try and get right here. Uh, oh, it's right on the edge, right? Right on the edge. So I can't get cover and be the edge. Can't get. I can't have my cake and eat it too. So my one order to land. Oh, I'm a little nervous about that eight. No, that's his own order. Yeah, yeah, this is his own order. Let's see if that is the eight. Measure it. All right, measure it. Up. You're right. <laughs> Six, yeah, six two. You're right. There it is. Okay. So I can't do anything about that. Fabulous. Let's grab some orders and shoot. Yeah. First order out of my six is going on him, and we're gonna shoot. Oh, you should move up first. Oh, oh to the cover. yeah, get in that cover. If, so I if I if I succeed in my change facing, then I'm facing you. I'm gonna need that. <laughs> You're gonna need that exactly. Okay. There we go. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna declare a dodge. Now that you're shooting me. I'm gonna declare a. Oh no, wait, I can't. It's completely out of my line of sight. I can change facing if I survive this. After I hit you. Right. Here we go. Three shots. I do hit you three times. Okay. And I gotta pass three armor rolls. I have armor zero. I gotta pass at least one. I pass one, so I'm Great. double unconscious. Okay. So now. This is very important for my uh, for my objectives here. Tiger Soldier has moved 4 2, so they're a little bit slow on that second one. So, my first order going on him. Uh, here goes my four. Anything? Nope. Okay. We'll do the two. Okay. And then one more order. For can I can, is a coup de grace short skill or a full? It's a short skill. Okay, so then I move and kill him. Move, yeah, right there, and coup de grace. Okay, so that will score me extreme prejudice. Uh, objective to perform a coup de grace against an unconscious or spawn embryo enemy model. So we just did that. The order. Uh, an order on this uh, tiger soldier here to walk over to this door and then spend a short skill to open it. We are going to spend order the second here to then walk through to here. Probably still not in range to do what I want to do, yeah. so I have to spend the other part of the short skill to get in right into the corner. And then my last order, we're going to try and do a data scan on this little robot. Uh, so, I will reset if I'm in range, and I am, okay. so I'll do a reset. And it, I'm, I'm definitely not an 8 here. Uh, that would be, be yeah. really good for I'll you. declare a hacking attack anyways. Yes. Uh, you're not an 8. Okay, it's just outside. Whew. Um, so let's do it. So I'm at, so you're at a minus three. Minus three. Uh, I'm at straight willpower. I actually don't know what my willpower is. I think it's thirteen or fourteen. Yeah, I'll go check. Yeah, with fourteen, so I need an eleven. And I need a thirteen. I got eight. Nineteen. Didn't so I do dodge it. it. Didn't do it. Uh, and I have no orders left. So Leo, it's your turn, number three. Okay. For um, I forgot these guys have some irregular orders still. So we will spend that to go four over here. Um, yeah, this guy can't see you either. Okay. Actually, what, yeah, what about these guys? Because this smoke is here. So... Yeah, no, I can't see what smoke is. So okay, we're good. Great. Um, so that's the first half. Second half, we'll just go... Oh, this guy. Let's go to there. Yep. And then this guy. Oh, right, because you can see through here with that back guy, right? Correct. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh, yeah, you didn't successfully drop the smoke there. No, yeah. Yeah, I totally no failed. I totally failed. There is no point in dropping another one. I'm Except just gonna smoke dodge to try yeah. to, get, to get in a better position. But. 
one or lost one? No, you know what? Let's just play it safe and just stay. Okay. Let's just stay, so we'll just burn that. Okay, now it's officially Leo's turn three. Awesome. Let's see what I can do. Yo, robot, it's gonna zip around the corner here, like this. For the first four. Yeah. And I'm gonna think I'm gonna move like two or something like that, because I don't I think I'll be out of hacking range, I'm hoping. You can, however, at this point declare a hack and check to see if I'm within hacking range and I can't do anything about it. I declare a hack, let's say, I don't know, some immobilized kind of thing. I'm not in. Okay. Uh, I'll spend another order on him. He's gonna move four in. Yeah. You can try to immobilize me. Carbonite's a good one because it gives me a minus three. Okay. Let's do that. Carbonite, it'll immobilize you and make you minus three. Yeah, I'll check what Carbonite does because I have the same person here. Sorry, guys, I'm Carbonite, super. No, it gives you a plus three. It gives me a plus three. Well, I like that. And I am going to try to immobilize you. Yeah. Uh, you might not be able to do that. What you call it? Mind blast? Yeah, I failed it at a mind You failed? I would have crit it, except I'm minus three. Uh, oh no, no, I crit it. Oh! <laughs> so I gotta wound you. Yeah, you've gotta crit too. You gotta so get a 17. 17. Oh, six! Close! So you take a wound and are down. Okay. And then I'll spend another order on this guy. Okay. To, uh, to try to uh, data scan you. Do the data scan. 10 will do it. Right. It nails it right on the nose, so I've succeeded at data scan. Boop. It's gonna move six to here. I don't think that thing can see me yet. Okay. Shell and Monk can't see me either. And it's gonna move four to like here. Right back here, actually. Just out of sight of your guy. Okay. Out of, out of line of sight of the Susie. Then I'll spin another order on it. I'm trying to come it's around. Go right next to the, the stairs here. And I can't see your Susie. Okay. Yeah, his base is out to like here. Yeah, and he's pretty tall. So. Yeah. All right. So now, now we declare stuff, right? Yep. And I think I'm in cover and you're in cover. Okay. So that would mean. Let me think about this. Oh yeah, that was the end of my. So the second. So you're declaring a dodge, right? I'm declaring a dodge. And I'm declaring a shoot. Oh, okay. So we're measuring the range. Yeah. Beyond 16. Beauty. So I'm hitting you on 15s on four dice, and I'll use armor piercing ammo. Uh -oh. Let's hope I get my dodge. And uh, you're gonna roll your dodge. Yeah. On a 14. Cool. Let's take this out. And I got a 10. Oh, what? I don't even know what that is. I got a four and a nine. Four, four, nine. Oh, right. Is that it's an right 11 or a angle. four? You wanna call it cocked? Yeah, sure. I have okay. to re-roll it, which means I'll probably fail it. So you succeed. Okay. All right. Go. You dodge. And you're right on the way. You're gonna retro engineering thing, right? So that I can be. There's no way I can get you there now. There you go. Is that his dog? To here. Okay. And what's that guy called? Uh, he's an auxilia, and he'll move his robot like way out here so that he can protect it. He, the robot moves like six, so I'm gonna move the robot out to here so it can protect a lot of stuff. He can get shot from a distance, but you have to climb up to it. He's got a heavy flamethrower, so he's protecting a good chunk of this area because they're coming around corners and stuff. I love it. Uh, and then he is going to. Uh, they can both shoot at it, but I don't think he's even remotely in range. I'm going to uh, forward observe him. Okay. So I need to succeed in a whip roll. Okay. Straight. Oh, that's your dice? Yeah. So it's 12s, and there's no, I'm pretty sure I have to be beyond 24 for it not to be a zero, so I'm good. Easy. I got it. So he is targeted. Okay. And that gives me my telemetry objective. Sweet. Telemetry scored. So I'll put a little take on that. Get it to focus. All right. To succeed in attack against an enemy, two breeze and forward reserver, or the spotlight hacking program. So there you go. He got it. Three down. So it's going to move three down. Oops. One over. And then another four. Okay. And then another, and then the last order, another four to get into base with this thing and try to heal it. Try and heal him. I'm hoping you fail in a big way. I know. I, I have willpower 12, so it's likely I'll kill it. <laughs> I succeed. It's up, and I get this one as well. Oh no. So, oh, no. three of these things, and you've got to try to get two more of them. Can, oh no, you I can only get can't. one more. You can only get one more. <laughs> so, I may have got you on this one. Yeah. We failed to give you some some huge, huge uh, build up for that, but that actually, with 
wins the game because there's no way that I can get either retro engineering or test run. Uh, I could get data scan, but that would put me at one, two, three, four points. And right now Leo is at one, two, three, four, five points. Uh, and then six, seven for having more than me. Four more points than me. Four more. I'm at nine. Yeah, you're at nine. So there you go. So yeah. that is that is the game with that roll right there. Um, well done, Leo. Let's Thank shake. You. Let's shake hands. Awesome. Let's do a little post game show. Talk about our thoughts and uh, and then we'll wrap it up. Well, that was pretty fun. That was. Good, uh, congratulations on the win. Thank you. Um, so here's here's my thoughts. Uh, as a new Infinity player, I actually had fun this game because nothing crazy or ridiculous happened. No insane surprises. Yeah. There, you did have one cool surprise. But I actually really liked it. it. Was shooting the rockets over the building. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Kind of laying waste to my ninja and my Shaolin monk. That was yes. fun. Though. It was fun. I felt like I maybe should have done that a little earlier, but it worked. It, worked. it did what it needed to. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and so uh, some cool, some other cool moments. Um, just something that I that I could have thought of uh, that Leo was pointing out just before we started filming this was I could have with my Sujia shot that bot dead. So yes. I couldn't have run over and repaired it. That would have been a smart move on my part. That would have been very critical because I would have had to hurt my tag deliberately, which he was being very smart about and just dodging away from it so that we didn't take any damage. And then my engineer would have nothing to heal. Yeah. And uh, my engineer was far, much too far away from his HVT at the end of the game for me to get to that point. Um, uh, we both got each other's secret objectives. Yeah. Yeah. That was cool. So, it was good. And I actually, I didn't have to switch it for secure HVT because yep, I, nope. just, I just went up and coup de grace that guy. The whole, yeah, the little robot was fun. I did, that was a dumb move on my part as well because I should have... I, I I think a little 40k. I'm like <laughs> I'm like I want my guys to point at the model they're shooting at, but that's not what you do in Infinity. You have to make sure your arc is covering the parts of the board you want to protect yourself from. And I could have very easily protected that robot by facing it the right way. Yeah, you would, uh, we were we were spinning them around saying, oh, this would have been better that yeah. after the fact, and, and uh, there there may have been a, a spot where I could jump in behind, but it would have been more dangerous for me, and so. Uh, but hey, that's how it goes, right? Yep. So. Uh, very fun. Thank you again for the game. Leo's super awesome dude. He's super gracious. He's a talented artist too, which is really neat. And uh, and so his army is beautiful. You got to you got to see that up close. Um, so that's the game. Stay tuned for more Infinity in the future. Hopefully we can pump out some more games, which will be which will be awesome. I got more stuff to paint. Um, and just to wrap up, if you liked this, jump down there, hit subscribe. If you really liked it and you want to support everything we do on the channel, you can go down to the Patreon link below, where for as little as a dollar a video, you can support the channel. So um, that's it, guys. We'll see you in our next encounter.